What if I told you that NASA just made the most shocking discovery in human history and then immediately tried to cover it up? The James Webb Space Telescope was quietly scanning Mercury when it detected something that shouldn't exist. Geometric structures and rhythmic signals that appear to be artificial. Within hours of this discovery, NASA abruptly shut down all Mercury observations, claiming technical issues. But leaked reports suggest they found evidence of intelligent design buried beneath Mercury's surface, and the implications are so staggering that they're scrambling to contain the information before it reaches the public. The James Webb Space Telescope, humanity's most advanced eye in the cosmos, turned its focus toward Mercury, the smallest and closest planet to the Sun. What it found was unlike anything astronomers expected. At first, the mission's purpose was simple, to study Mercury's thin atmosphere and extreme surface temperatures. But as Webb's infrared instruments began mapping the planet in unprecedented detail, something strange began to appear. Across the scorched surface of Mercury, scientists detected patterns, not random, but deliberate-looking shapes. Long, geometric lines crisscrossed the terrain, forming perfectly straight intersections and angular structures that nature doesn't typically create on its own. Some of these formations stretched for kilometers, connecting in ways that resembled corridors or the remnants of vast grids buried beneath layers of rock and dust. Even more baffling were the heat-emitting anomalies Webb recorded near Mercury's equatorial region. In a world where the daytime side can reach over 430 degrees Celsius, you wouldn't expect to find concentrated heat signatures that pulse rhythmically, almost as if following a timed sequence. Yet, that's exactly what the telescope picked up, bursts of infrared light that appeared and disappeared in repeating intervals, synchronized like a pattern rather than chaos. If you love exploring the cosmos, subscribe now and like this video for more incredible space discoveries. At first, scientists thought it might be a calibration error or interference caused by the sun's intense radiation, but the data held consistent through multiple scans. When the images were compared with older data from missions like MESSENGER, the locations of these anomalies matched areas that had always puzzled planetary scientists, regions once thought to be volcanic but now showing clear evidence of precision geometry. The discovery left researchers stunned. Could these be remnants of ancient structures buried beneath Mercury's crust? Could an advanced civilization, long before Earth's recorded history, have used Mercury for a purpose we can't yet comprehend? Or is there a more natural, yet unknown geological process at work? One that mimics artificial design? Whatever the answer, one fact became undeniable. Mercury was no longer just a dead, sun-scorched world. It had secrets, secrets so complex and so deliberate looking that NASA quietly began reviewing Webb's data behind closed doors. And that's when things took a strange turn. Not long after the discovery of Mercury's mysterious geometric formations, the James Webb team began noticing something even stranger, a series of repeating energy emissions coming from deep beneath the planet's surface. At first, these readings were dismissed as background interference from solar radiation. But then the pattern repeated, again and again. Webb's infrared sensors, designed to detect faint heat signatures across billions of light years, had locked onto a pulse. It wasn't random thermal noise. It was structured, showing a rhythm that seemed deliberate. Every few hours, a faint but distinct surge of infrared energy would rise from the same coordinates, fade then rise again, almost as if the planet itself was transmitting something. Scientists double-checked everything. They recalibrated Webb's instruments, compared the readings with data from previous probes like MESSENGER and MARINER-10, and even ruled out potential echoes from solar flares. Yet the pattern held firm. Whatever was buried beneath Mercury's crust was releasing heat in a steady, coded-like sequence, one that eerily resembled binary timing. As the analysis deepened, Researchers noticed that some of these emissions corresponded with surface fractures that aligned perfectly with the geometric grid seen earlier. It was as if the formations above and the pulses below were connected, functioning together like a vast machine or a buried network responding to some ancient programming. The more data Webb sent back, the more the mystery grew. 
The emissions weren't strong enough to be volcanic or seismic. They carried no known natural frequency, no seismic wave patterns, and no correlation with solar wind impacts. Instead, they appeared to originate from a specific depth beneath the crust, as if something massive, perhaps metallic, was absorbing and then releasing energy in timed intervals. Whispers began circulating within the scientific community. Some theorized it could be an ancient power source, long dormant, but somehow reactivated by Webb's infrared probing. Others speculated that Mercury might house a vast subterranean structure, possibly artificial, still responding to environmental triggers. And then came the most chilling revelation. During one observation cycle, the rhythmic emissions suddenly changed pattern. The timing shifted, the intervals tightened, and for a brief period, Webb recorded what appeared to be a sequence resembling encoded data, a pulse, pause, and double pulse rhythm that mirrored a message. Was it just coincidence, or something intelligent acknowledging that it had been found? Whatever it was, the transmission was logged, and soon after, NASA quietly restricted all web data related to Mercury. Public access was revoked, internal discussions were sealed, and the telescope's focus was redirected to deep space targets. But the timing was too suspicious to ignore. Webb had just uncovered something buried, active, and possibly ancient beneath Mercury's blazing surface, and the world was suddenly not allowed to see it. After the mysterious geometric patterns and rhythmic energy pulses were detected on Mercury, the James Webb Space Telescope's data feed became the center of intense scrutiny. For days, analysts at NASA and the European Space Agency worked around the clock, rechecking the readings. The data was too consistent to ignore and too strange to explain. Then, without warning, everything changed. In the middle of a scheduled observation window, NASA abruptly halted all web operations targeting Mercury. The official statement cited thermal calibration concerns and the need to protect the telescope's instruments from solar interference. On paper, it sounded reasonable. Mercury's proximity to the sun makes it a dangerous target, but inside the agency, whispers began to spread. According to insiders, the decision didn't come from the web operations team, but from higher up, a sudden directive marked as classified. Engineers and researchers who had been analyzing the anomalous data were told to cease all study and redirect focus toward exoplanet imaging instead. The archived Mercury files were locked behind restricted access, and even collaborating institutions were cut off overnight. That's when speculation exploded. Why shut down one of the most significant planetary observations in history? Why hide data that could lead to new geological discoveries? Unless the truth wasn't geological at all. Several researchers noticed that, just hours before the shutdown, Webb's telemetry had captured one final burst of energy from Mercury, a sudden spike in infrared emissions far stronger than before. For nearly seven minutes, the readings intensified, showing what looked like a massive surge of heat rising from the same coordinates where the rhythmic signals had originated. Then silence. It was as if something below Mercury's crust had powered up and then gone dark. Within 24 hours, the web system's pointing schedule was rewritten. No new Mercury observations were planned, no follow-ups were authorized, and the word Mercury disappeared entirely from Webb's next month mission log. Some scientists quietly archived copies of the data, fearing it might be erased, while others suspected that NASA had just found something it couldn't explain or couldn't risk explaining. The public never got to see the full infrared maps. The only images released were cropped, filtered, and stripped of metadata. The official line remained the same, instrument safety and calibration protocols. But behind the scenes, it seemed clear the shutdown wasn't about safety. It was about secrecy. Whatever the Webb telescope had uncovered on Mercury, whether a natural anomaly or the trace of something artificial, it was powerful enough to make NASA go silent. And when silence replaces science, it usually means the truth is far bigger than anyone's ready to admit. If the anomalies detected on Mercury are confirmed, the consequences would be nothing short of revolutionary. For centuries, humans have looked to the stars, searching for signs of life or intelligence far beyond our solar system. We assume that if intelligent civilizations existed, they would be light years away, orbiting distant exoplanets. 
Yet the James Webb Telescope suggests that the first hints of intelligence might be right in our cosmic backyard. The geometric formations, rhythmic subsurface emissions, and heat anomalies hint at something beyond natural processes, patterns that could indicate purposeful design. If Mercury once housed or still houses structures, machines, or even information systems, it would mean that our solar system was shaped, influenced, or observed by an intelligence long before humanity existed. Earth may not be the starting point of consciousness, but merely a late participant in a much larger story. The implications stretch across science, philosophy, and culture. Planetary science may need to be rewritten. Our understanding of Mercury, long dismissed as a barren, scorched rock, would shift from curiosity to central importance. Missions to Mars or Europa may now seem secondary to uncovering the secrets buried beneath Mercury's crust. And beyond science, humanity's identity and place in the cosmos could change forever. Mercury, once overlooked, may be the keeper of knowledge, a sentinel or relic left in the harshest, most protected part of the solar system. Its proximity to the sun may have preserved these structures and signals, hiding them in plain sight until a telescope as sensitive as Webb could detect them. It raises profound questions. Was Mercury intentionally chosen? Is it a repository of intelligence, or even a functioning system left active for eons? While NASA's abrupt shutdown paused observations, the implications cannot be hidden. The data already captured challenges everything we thought we knew about the inner solar system. Mercury is no longer just a rocky neighbor. It has become a gateway to understanding intelligence, history, and perhaps the origins of life itself. The brief glimpse Webb provided may be humanity's first real encounter with something ancient, deliberate, and intelligent, and it forces us to confront the possibility that we are not the first, nor the only, players in the solar system. What lies beneath Mercury's surface may hold answers to questions that have haunted humanity for millennia. Who we are, where we came from, and whether intelligence is rare or woven into the very fabric of the cosmos. Mercury's secrets are now out of the shadows. Webb's fleeting focus has illuminated a story billions of years in the making, and the echoes of this discovery will ripple through science, culture, and human consciousness for generations to come. Before you go, don't miss what comes next. Click on the video in the end screen to continue exploring the mysteries of the universe, see more mind-blowing interstellar discoveries. Trust me, you'll want to watch every second. The journey is only getting wilder.